What's up, nerds and nerdettes and wee little nerdlings all? <laughs> it's your buddy, Big Johnny G for two. Gun Pixie presents Legendary Gaming. Wednesdays. All right, my regulars here know Wednesdays we need unboxing. Every Wednesday, there's going to be something new getting unboxed here at Two Gun Fixing. We've been doing this for like, like five years, six years now. Just constant unboxings every week. It's awesome. We're doing this all for fun. That's right, we're doing this all for fun. We don't have any backers or patrons or sponsors. We're just doing this for the love of board gaming and RPG. And, ah, and today, today, this is all in the bag. I mean, this is all together. And we're going to find out. And we're going to find out together, because that's the way you should do things, especially with gaming, right? So join me, my friends, and you and me, we will find out what's, <laughs> what's in that Pixie's box. All right, well, you come down to the table and join me. And here we go, Bag of Dungeon 2, The Cursed Forest. Now, uh, I just want to put out a, a little note there that this was sent to me by Gunpowder Studios. And uh, so this was uh, this was gifted to me to make videos of. Uh, they saw my videos concerning the first game. And they saw a video of mine having this on the gaming radar. Saying I thought this was, uh, this was definitely worthy to be on any board gamers the gaming radar and maybe even on their table so they enjoyed the videos and they decided to uh, reach out and uh, send me one and they also sent me the character expansion so now I've, I allegedly I have all the all the characters between the expansion between this and between the first game so foo are you excited oh, are you so excited to get into the cursed forest no you don't want to get into the for cursed forest Oh, you're afraid of werewolves. Well, I mean, I don't blame you. I mean, they're pretty scary. You don't want to be a werefoo, do you? Oh, you're already a part werefoo. Look at those ears. You just don't want to go full. Okay, I get it. I get it. All right, well, what do you say, foo? Why don't we uh, get into the unboxing here and check this out? I really think the fact that this is not only a standalone, but you can combine this with the first games. So you can make it like, you know, combining the dungeon and the outdoor terrain stuff. That's, that's really cool. That was very nice thinking. So you you, uh, you ready here, foo? All right, let me let me yeah, search your mind here for your blades. Where is it? You took the other blades. Uh, all right, I got right there. Oh, not the one I was expecting, but okay. Uh, I don't know what you do with the other blade. Should I ask? Okay. All right, why don't we get you off to a safe location over here, foo? The incomparable Fu Man Shoe, everyone. <laughs> All right, now be very careful with the sharp items. Please always be very careful. If you are using a sharp item, always cut away from yourself. All right, we uh, got through the unboxing, unbagging, anyway, we unboxing, yeah, we got the cellophane off. What does it say over here? From the makers of Bag of Dungeon comes a new adventure. The once beautiful elven forest of Kalintor has become a cursed and poisoned place, full of evil creatures. Dare you enter its deadly realm to seek the ancient maiden tree and lift the curse? Brave adventurers, step out of the light. And into the dark. Nice. A cool little lineup. Let's see what's inside this mighty box. Okay. Ooh, the Curse of Kalintor. A story. Oh, a little story. Look at that. 
Oh, that's nice. I'll have to read this at some point. Off camera, obviously. Do you want me to read it on camera? I mean, not right now. You want me to do a reading of it? Let me know. Here's the rules. And it looks set up very similar to, to the other one, Bag of Dungeon 1. Which means, I'm hoping that means, that uh, it's similarly easy. Uh -huh. Some nice little tokens and chips pop out fairly easily. Look at that. There we go. Very easily. Good quality. All right, we'll have to check out all of those. Oh, we got more. Um, there's going to be a whole lot of these, isn't there? There better be. We need all the tiles to build out the, the well, I was going to say the dungeon. Build out the forest path. Ooh, that doesn't look good. Serapod. A forest spirit. A black willow. Hmm. Deadly foes indeed. What are those spiders? The webs. Oh, just to bedevil you. I'm really looking forward to to this and combining of the two, huh? That's cool. You, yep, item bag and your monster bag, just like the original game. Is that for your for your dungeon? Bag of dungeon two. Okay. Yeah, you yeah, you need your cubes to keep track of things. Wooden cubes. And uh, please remember whenever you get anything like this, just don't eat this, will you? Don't eat that. Another one in here with the meeples. You see the meeples? Oh, looks like everything here got nice little wooden components. That's what it was with the first game, too. Uh, get rid of that. Get the monster meeple. Look at that big guy. Everyone else going on here? Huh. Cool. And then the dice. Wooden dice. The first time I've ever seen wooden dice was in uh, Dungeon Dice. Yeah, I get a copy of that game again. Good childhood game. Again, more of the stuff. Don't eat this, will you? There we go. And then we got the uh, we got the characters, the heroes that you can play in this game. Look at the back. That looks cool. With the playable heroes, you have uh, the Air Core, the Half Ogre, Neo Core, Astasia, the Changeling. This is a really interesting cast of characters. Wise Leaf, the Guardian. It's like like a like an Ent. Trent. Moonbeam, the Fairy. Well, I guess Two Gun Fix is gonna have to play a game too as the Moonbeam, the Fairy. Trig, the Rogue. There's a lot of characters here. Tamil the Herbalist. Thanelaw the Wizard. Is this like the Kickstarter edition or something? Sirja the Hunter. Oh, that's everything you get in here. But now, uh, now hold on. Because there's also a Bag of Legends character expansion that you can get. So let's take a look at these uh, extra characters in here. Even more. I mean, wow, there's a lot of characters. I, I think there's more in the second game than there was I got in the first. Ah, unseal it. Nice little production value on the uh, sealed letter. Very nice production. Oh. What's the. Oh. Trickster Elf. I don't want any of this. Hold on a second. Let's. Okay, so. Bag of Dungeon. Gunpowder Studios. Player's Guide. Okay, so gaining skill tokens and skill tokens. Spells. Umari. Umari can cast four spells per game and spend a skill token to cover the spells uh, and cast it. Ooh, got a spellcaster. Nice. Hidden agenda for multiplayer. Oh, nice. That's cool. That's cool. I, I want, this is the uh, 
This must be like the hidden agenda things then. Well, for one, you will receive plus two kills at the end of the game if you never refuse the tag request. Yeah. Well, for me, you will receive plus two kills at the end of the game if you refuse all tag requests. Okay, so that's what... Got a nice little bunch of those over here. Ooh, so we have... Uh, Grakun the Minotaur. Firkin the Halfling. And Umari the Wizard. Polymorph, Ethereal Sword, Teleport, and Ice Storm. All right, seems to be the spells available. And so I'm still not 100% sure what these are. Hidden agenda? Oh, here's a list of the hidden agendas. Skill tokens. Oh, maybe these are skills. Crusader, Skirmisher for a Fighter, Wizard or Mystic. Ah, okay. To uh, increase the game a little bit more, make it a little bit more interesting, a little bit more replayability, I guess. I'm definitely going to have to look into that. So, all right, that is uh, whew, that was a that's a nice amount of stuff. Uh, everything here that we're getting between the the expansion players, uh, actually player heroes, and the game itself. Hmm. Get ready to check this out. All right, so thank you for joining me for the unboxing here at Bag of Dungeon Two: The Cursed Forest. I'm your buddy Big John at Jeeva 2 Gun Pixel Presents Legendary Gaming and I am